back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a how to have the best summer ever video and it's definitely summer related obviously. Um, so in this video I'm just going to show you tips and things that you can do to have the best summer ever and to actually do things this summer because every summer I know everybody says oh we're going to do this but ne nothing ever happens. Start off with activities. Um, obviously one activity is hanging out with your friends and some activities that you could do with hanging out with your friends are going to the drugstore to get face masks or snacks to watch movies. shopping not just to purchase things but to also look and see what's out there and see what I can include in my wardrobe. Um, another thing that you can do with your friends is going camping. Um, I recently went camping with my friends and it was super fun and we went to Yosemite. We did it right after school ended so that was super fun. Another thing you can do with your friends is taking small trips. I just went with my friend to Pismo Beach and it was so fun and I think I got Tanner which I'm really really excited about. Um, so yeah, just small trips, it doesn't have to be all the way to Mexico or China or Alaska, but it can be like to your nearest beach town. It's travel. Now I know not every summer people can travel. I can't definitely, I definitely can't travel like on a big family trip every summer, but this summer me and my family are actually going to Puerto Vallarta, which is in Mexico, and I'm super excited and definitely watch out for a travel diary. But um, those trips just help me relax and I'm doing it kind of before school starts so it's going to help me kind of relax before school. Moving on to your room. Now I love organizing my room when I don't have to. I usually keep things pretty clean because I'm not stressed out with school and I don't just throw off my clothes and put it on my pajamas. Right? But definitely organizing your makeup, washing out your makeup brushes, trying new room decor which I'm also in the middle of. So now moving on to self care. Take great care of your skin. You can do that by drinking water to um, washing your face with cleansers. Yeah, putting on face masks, I suggest blush because that's a really good store to go for face masks. Um, yeah, cleansers, rose waters, toners, drinking water. So now another thing for self-care is obviously eating healthy and exercising. This is a big tip because you have time to do things this summer. So it's not like, oh, I'm too busy. I can't work out for 30 minutes. Like 30 minutes is not that much time, but it's enough to get in a pretty good workout if you go constantly. Snacks, foods, and drinks I like to consume during the summer is LaCroix. So LaCroix is kind of like a soda, but without preservatives, without chemicals, without added sugars. There's actually zero sugars in it. Um, and it's fruit, like it's fruit tasting and it's bubbly water that's fruit tasting, has a fruit flavor in it. Our rice crackers, especially the flavored ones, but definitely try and watch out for preservatives and chemicals again and like high sodium rates. Just try and get a clean, like clean foods. Um, another thing that I really like throughout this summer is smoothies and acai bowls. I love these two things because they're cold and that's exactly what I crave and they're also sweet. So after dinner, a lot of the times I will have a smoothie because it's just something sweet and after a meal I usually like to have something sweet. Our salads, um, I like a lot of different types of salad. I love vinegar salads like just vinegar and salt and pepper. I also love like Italian dressing type of thing salad. I also love Caesar salad. So salads are a great thing for you obviously. Now another thing with self-care is reading books and lighting candles. These two are kind of different, but they're the same in which they calm me down. I read before I go to bed because it helps me calm down. Obviously, I've said this a million times throughout this past sentence. Um, but yeah, books are really fun to read. And like now that you don't have school, it's not like you need to read to page 105 by Wednesday at 2 p.m. Like, no, you can choose to read for your own pleasure, which I really love. Candles also help me relax. I like, they're kind of like aromatherapy. I just learned that word and now I'm like really into it because it makes me sound like a scientist. Candles smell good and like nice smells help me calm down, I guess. 
this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this summer related video and definitely watch out for more content coming soon because I really want to try and make super fun videos to watch. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.